Hello everyone, I'm Paul and I've been challenged. I've been tagged by Ben from the channel When Work Is Play. Ben's channel is a great channel. He owns a B2601 Kubota tractor and he has challenged me to show my top five tractor add-ons. If you get a chance, go watch Ben's channel. I'll leave a link to his channel in the description. He's a very clever individual. He makes a lot of things for his tractor that you may be interested in. So anyways, to get on to my, before I get on to my top five add-ons, I also, at the end of this video, will tag three other individuals and I'll leave links to their channels in the description down below. So let's get started on my top five add-ons. My first one and one that I use the most is my grapple. I have a land pride claw grapple and it's very light. If you look here, the tines on it are nice and light. It's a AR 400. And this here is used almost daily. And the reason why I put a light one on is because I lift a lot of heavy logs. In order to lift the logs, I want as much capacity. Um, I didn't want any extra weight on the tractor itself. So that's my number one. My number two is here in the back. And it's my quick attach. My quick attach hitch here, basically it's great for adding anything that I want to attach to it, or the box plate or whatever I want to attach to it. But it's also fantastic for hanging my chains, as you can see here, that I use often. I always hang my tie or my uh, ratchet straps here. I always have a hitch here. Uh, I've got a lot of trailers that I move around a lot. And I also keep my headphones and my earmuffs on here as well. And in addition to that, whenever I can't lift something with the front end because it doesn't have the ability to do it, what I do is I use this quick attach and the chains and I chain around it and it's able to lift logs that are much heavier than with the front end. So this is my number two. My third one is over here on the side. This is something that I made and this is my Spider-Man chainsaw holder. It is metal and it holds different sizes of chainsaws that I have and I'm always needing a chainsaw on the side of the tractor. So this is a great one for me. My number four top tractor pick is my 10 foot two by eight laminated boom. It's held together with a bunch of carriage bolts. It's clamped in using my grapple and then I have some ratchet straps as a secondary support to hold it in place. This is perfect for me to lift things up high, whether it's to put something on the roof, whether it's shingles or I need to load something up the top, or to load something into my trailer, or if I just need to lift something up high. You can see here what I use is a strap. It's a tree hugger strap. And I use a shackle here to attach anything that I want to lift up. So I'll just show you a quick demo of lifting it up. I'm not gonna actually put anything on. Alright guys, you can see there I get quite a bit of height. Um, the one thing I normally would do is have a counterweight on the back. Um, not always, depends on what I'm lifting, but uh, it's a perfect add-on for me. Alright guys, for my fifth 
and last top tractor add-on that I have it's the mirrors on my tractor I have three of them first two here are on the side of the tractor you can see here they allow me to see off to the side they weren't adequate enough for me to uh, use so I've added a third mirror and it's up here on my canopy and it's a rear view mirror you can see basically what I see here, I can see it more at a distance. Hopefully you can see that in the camera. Or I can see directly behind me, you can see the implement or whatever I attach to the back of the tractor. It's nice and it's adjustable. Uh, if you have hair, you can also you know comb your hair if you need. I really do like these things. They really come in handy uh, so I don't back up into anything because I'm in the bush a lot. And for a bonus, this is my bonus add-on and it's the horn that I installed it's nice and loud it works really well I only use it on occasion but when I get the chance to use it to beep someone out I really enjoy that all right guys that brings us to the point in the video where I want to challenge three other excellent channels to show their top five tractor add-ons and the very first one is John from the Bradleys on Catbird Hill. John has an L2501 Kubota tractor. In addition to that, he recently purchased a Woodland Mills HM130 Max sawmill. So if you're into that kind of stuff, check out John's channel. The second one is Jeff from Tennessee Yankee. Jeff has a great channel as well. He has a Kubota LX2610, same tractor as I do. But Jeff has a lot of implements, attachments for his tractor. He does a lot of how-tos and also he does a lot of product review. Another great channel. The third channel, but not least, is Dragonfly Projects and Homestead. Alex has a great channel. He has a lot of Christmas trees and fruit trees on his farm. In addition to his L4060 cabbed Kubota tractor. So hopefully you guys are going to check all these channels out. They're great channels. They have a lot of interesting content on their channels. And once again, guys, I challenge you guys to produce your top five tractor add-ons. Thanks for watching. If you have not subscribed to my channel, you can do so by hitting that subscription button down below. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Once again, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on Gelling Outdoors.